All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and show how to do the cat five the way that we do it. So take a piece of cat five and come down about maybe three quarters of an inch. Look at your thumbnail, come down about that far. I use these Harbor Freight strippers and I actually just strip it myself, put it around there, apply light pressure, rotate, and I always apply such light pressure. It usually takes two times. All right, then you've got your wires. So there's your wires. And look at the head like this. And we're going to put the wires in to the head. We're going to start with the B pattern, which is, in my opinion, the most common. Go ahead and get these out and loose. B pattern leaves the blue in the center, surrounded by green, and then surrounded by orange. So I kind of make it like a plus sign to get it ready. Then come down here, flip it to the correct way, get your brown and your orange ready, then plop down your green. These go alternating, so the striped one is every other one. Once you get it in a fanned out pattern that's going to work, get them real close together and see where the cables line up. If you don't if they don't start to line up, they're going to be hard to put in. So that's why we want to get them done now. So once you get them pretty flat I take this opportunity to trim them since they are now uneven once they are trimmed verify that they're in the right order brown brown white green blue white blue green white orange and orange you're gonna slide all the cables in making sure they go in the channels all the way once you get them in there Seat them to the end, flip it upside down, you'll see that they're all there. Once you get that done, take your crimpers, slide it in all the way, squeeze them down. I usually do it twice, make sure they hit, and pop this out just a little bit, and it is on. That's all you need, and you will see that the wires are correctly lined up let me know if that helps you go ahead and like subscribe and so on to the video